beauty so for today's video i want to share with you four 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 of my favorite spf sunblock so if you have very sensitive skin that i want to share with you my favorites i have two for the face and two for the body so if you're interested in that then keep watching by the way welcome my name is jen if you're new and please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and let's get started so first i'm going to start with what I use on my face and these are like daily I always put SPF every day winter spring summer fall I'm very cautious of sun damage but I also have to be very careful because my face is so prone to getting clogged acne I'm oily so I thought this one was perfect and I've been using it for years now if you've watched any of my makeup tutorials you will see that i always start applying my spf before my makeup i love this one from clinique this is the broad spectrum spf 50 i believe they also have it in 30 if you don't need it as high and this is uva uvb protection face cream so this is specifically for the face no clinique is very good if you have sensitive skin allergy tested a hundred percent fragrance free photo allergy tested not sure what that is dermatologist tested what i love the most and the reason i got this is because this is oil free if you're new to my channel uh when it comes to makeup skincare i always try for it to be oil free it's just my preference i feel that it won't clog my pores non-acnegenic i agree a hundred percent everybody's skin is different though but this does not break me out which is so important i want to protect myself from the sun but i don't want it to break me out you know it could be so heavy so it says it's appropriate for sensitive skin this is a 1.7 ounce it really lasts because i have to apply a lot this is like a new one that i have it is white i just have so many but it is white I'll show you really quickly, but you don't have any white, like a white cast. It blends to a nice clear lotion. Complete. It doesn't feel greasy. That's what I love. So good if you have very sensitive skin and you haven't tried this, try it. Of course, the drugstore has very good as well. Maybe by Neutrogena. There's several brands, but this is just the one I use and I just wanted to share that with you. The next one I have is a little bit more pricey, but this is so good. Also, very sensitive skin. And this is by the brand Elta MD. And this is a tinted one. This is not a lot. Like, when it says tinted, you may think, like, oh, my God, really? But you see, this is not, like, white like the other one. And if I blend it out, it just gives you, like, a little bit of color. You see? Like, I'm so fair, and you could barely see that. But, like, it'll just give you a little bit of coverage if you wanted something extra. And this is a UV Broad Spectrum SPF 46. So, it's almost the same as this one. And this one says it calms and protects acne-prone skin, high-purity, transparent zinc oxide, UVA, UVB protection, facial sunscreen. And this is skin types prone to acne rosacea and hyperpigmentation it's like specially for acne prone for a sensitive skin this is a transparent zinc oxide so you can't really see it whatsoever as you see it doesn't look like very luminous like you're gonna look like a grease ball whatsoever we'll definitely try to link all of these down below just in case you're interested just check the description i'll try to put links now we're moving on to the body so the first one i want to tell you about is by neutrogena like i said they're very good for sensitive skin as well this is the neutrogena beach defense water and sun protection this is spf 70 i've seen it as well maybe in 30 maybe 50 but i like to use the highest i can if you didn't see my video i recently just got like a really bad sunburn it was like insane and yeah but that's another story and this is number one dermatologist recommended for skincare and it says to apply every 80 minutes of course i reapply even sooner just in case and again what i love oil free so just in case you're looking for oil free this is for you these as well 
So this is oil-free, lightweight, fast absorbing. I love that this comes in a spray. That is my favorite thing. If you don't like to um, deal with creams, this is so good, guys. And this is 6.5 ounces. It doesn't break me out. So it says defense against signs of water damage as well. Again, this is the Neutrogena Beach Defense water and sun protection i love the color yellow as you see it matches my nails i'm like so obsessed with yellow this year i don't know why this one it's so good as well i mean sensitive skin this is from avino and this is the baby one and i actually bought this one because i was doing tattoo laser removal and they suggested that I needed something that had a high zinc oxide in it. And this, in, this one has 21.6%, which is much higher than any other. But that's what they suggested. If I wanted to go to the beach after getting tattoo removal, you needed something really high. This is a continuous protection, sensitive skin, lotion, zinc oxide sunscreen. Broad spectrum 50 as well. And this is mineral protection tear free paraben free so you know it's for babies is extra sensitive but it good coverage you know babies are going to have very sensitive skin and the zinc oxide here is extremely high which is a plus and you're supposed to apply it every 80 minutes i do it even more often because i'm just way too sensitive so this one the only thing with this one it it is extremely white this is the thing when it's very high on zinc oxide you might have a white cast but if you don't care about that and you need extreme protection that's the only downside from this i mean you could try to blend it out but you're just gonna have to work and just really blend it but as you see it's not that white anymore but that's the only thing this is a cream this is a spray your preference what you like so i hope that helped you out please give this video a thumbs up i'll be posting a video so you can see my beach bag essentials everything i take on the beach and also my travel bag essentials what i love to take for traveling that's more like makeup skincare edition i'll put a playlist of those if you want to watch and i will see you guys in my next video bye